Click subscribe to get latest news and don't forget to press the bell icon. The tension between the U.S. and North Korea has reached an all-time high. Now, more than ever, leaders around the world have been on their toes, wondering what Kim Jong-un would do next. It seems that now we have an answer. According to CNBC, North Korea has fired one of their ballistic missiles, and it ended up passing over the country of Japan. This action occurred after North Korea made the threat that they would attack the U.S. territory of Guam. A South Korean military official confirmed that the missile was fired around 5.57 a.m. local time. All predictions have stated that the missile will come down at 6.29 a.m. After news of the missile launch reached Japan, the Japanese government issued an urgent warning that the missile was in the area, and currently heading towards the Toaku region. It was reported that everyone was told to take shelter. Furthermore, no attempts occurred to shoot down the missile. The Japanese government was aware that an attack could be executed following North Korea's threats. This is the first time that North Korea has fired a missile over Japanese airspace since 1998. This action demonstrates that Kim is becoming brasher than ever before. Concerns are high that this may be another test of many before North Korea attempts to attack the United States or any of their neighbors. President Trump has spoken against a dictatorship over the summer as he threatened to hit not just the U.S. territories, but the U.S. mainland. Confirmation came through the Twitter page, Albo Breaking News where they said that the missile fired by North Korea had in fact passed over Japan. It is worth speculating whether or not their target was Guam, or even closer to home. President Trump has stated multiple times that if North Korea decides to strike, the U.S. will retaliate. A series of tweets and speeches demonstrate that regardless of how strong the North Koreans think they are, the U.S. has the power and the will to stop them. One of the president's tweets reads, Military solutions are now fully in place, locked and loaded, should North Korea act unwisely. Hopefully, Kim Jong-un will find another path. Trump's stance on North Korea is much stronger than that of the previous administrations. Kim must be approached as a serious threat, the lives of many Americans hang in the balance. After news broke that North Korea could attack Guam, Trump stated in a press conference, Let's see what, Kim Jong-un does with Guam. He does something in Guam, it will be an event the likes of which nobody has seen before, what will happen in North Korea? According to another tweet issued by Elbow Breaking News, there were two missiles fired not just one. One of the missiles crashed off into the East Sea. This is still an active situation. Considering North Korea's unpredictability, it's difficult to determine what they will bring to the table next. Stay tuned for more information about this story as it continues to break.